Hey Filmmaker Shun here. In this quick tutorial, we're going to talk about the master effects control inside of Premiere Pro. So what that means if we look at effects controls here, we have here one part saying master and then the clip name. And normally it's actually always selected on the sequence and then the clip name. But if we actually go to a clip here, select it, it will just go to the master. So if you haven't noticed, if you double click your clip, it will actually go to the master, which means if you add a effect, it will affect this entire clip. So this clip I've already actually cut up here. So you can see several clips here that has the same name. So if I changed something, it would basically change the entire uh, all these clips in one go instead of that me that I need to put an adjustment layer or like go for every clip and put an effect on it can just put a clip on this in uh, yeah main clip here so um, yeah so this one is 003 so I select this one and I'm gonna add an effect so actually I need to put the effects here in this here so we're now in the master of this clip. So we're gonna put the Lumage color here. So if I'm gonna change here, for example, go to basic control here, and we just literally drop the saturation. You can see here this clip and this clip here, this color has changed. So I can change it back here. So put saturation back to normal. So these clips we can see normally has color and then literally go to the master here, drop the saturation and the clips, both clips have changed the color. So it makes it much faster to do like color grading uh, that you just only color grade a clip instead of having go through and put on every of these clip a color grade or you have to have like an additional adjustment layer on top. So it just makes things easier just to do a direct clip or uh, yeah, direct color grade onto the master. So also we, cause we see like this Lumetri color being in the master, if we click the sequence here, we don't see the effect here. So it's only on the master itself. However, not every effect work on the master and not every preset you can drag and drop onto the master, but most color grading stuff, uh, crop and certain simple effects often works with the master though. But mainly, personally for me, I use it more for grading, especially if you have like uh, one single clip where you have like your talking and the rest is are just B-roll you put on top. That single long clip, uh, often you cut up in parts. So afterwards, if you need to do any color grading changes, it makes it much easier to just directly do it in master instead of having to go through every clip. So that was mainly it. Hope you guys learned something from this tutorial. Hope you found it very interesting. And if you have any questions, please comment below. And uh, if you are new to this channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button here below. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you be safe out there and love you all and see you out.